you know, sometimes the best place to think and to reflect and to ponder the day's chores is on a lawnmower or a tractor. I, I don't know what it is about the, the roar of the engine and the, and the steadiness of the, the progress that just makes, it just helps me think. It's, it's my, my thinking place. And this morning I, I wanted to share a word with you. Uh, it's, a, it's a word of encouragement. It's found in Psalms 46. It starts like this. God is our refuge and strength, always ready to help in times of trouble. So we will not fear when earthquakes come and the mountains crumble into the sea. Let the oceans roar and foam. Let the mountains tremble and the waters surge. A river brings joy to the city of our God, the sacred home of the Most High. God dwells in that city and it cannot be destroyed. From the very break of day, beginning of the day, right? God will protect it. The nations are in chaos and their kingdoms crumble. So true. God's voice thunders and the earth melts. The Lord of heaven's armies is here among us. The God of Israel is our fortress. Come see the glorious works of the Lord. See how he brings destruction upon the world. He causes wars to end throughout the earth. He breaks the bow and snaps the spear. He burns the shield with fire. Verse 10 is one of my favorites, right? Be still and know that I am God. I will be honored by every nation. I will be honored throughout the world. The Lord of heaven's armies is here among us. The God of Israel is our fortress. Wherever you find your place of thinking, wherever you find your place of quiet, even if it's on a noisy old tractor, be still and know that He is God. He is our refuge and our strength. He is still God, the Lord of heaven's armies. This trouble doesn't surprise him. It shouldn't surprise us. Hey, my friends, have a wonderful day and be encouraged. Be blessed.